Go back to Mark 7 and 21. When you don't convert your mind over to the laws of God, you say never? Why not? I don't know. I don't know. Only the Lord knows, sir. Why not? You know what it is. Okay, okay. All right. Why I'm giving you correction anyway, but you're my brother and I love you. I know, I like the honesty and stuff. Watch this. Read. The book of Mark, chapter 7, and verse 21. For from within, out of the heart of man, proceed evil thoughts, adulteries, fornication, murders, thefts, and covetousness. And what? And covetousness, wickedness, deceit, lachiousness, and evil eye. Blasphemy, pride, foolishness. And these are the things we're trying to repent from. Go back to Acts 3 and 19, sir. I know, I know. So we got to fix our community and stuff. Don't you want to be a good pillar? Of course. Yeah, be a good good example to the church oh, okay? love if you love them hey if you love them hey man you try to keep the commandment I know man what do you do to help your people he made a statement I'm going to ask you what do you do to help your people because a lot of people try to help our people Mark Luther King Malcolm X all of them fail because why they didn't have the law of the God how do you fight for them sir what's the truth I'm not going to sit up here and fight big and Okay, okay. Okay, watch this though. Read. This is the book of Acts, chapter 3, and verse 19. This is how you help your people by fixing yourself first, sir. I know it. Repent ye therefore, and be converted, that your sins may be blotted out. I have to. Give me Judah 8 and 24, because all people, we just want to be like, I'm going to do my own thing. I love my people. I'm going to do my own thing. Well, we got to be an example. Shoot up 8 and 24. We need to be an example and stuff. I know. Keeping God's commandments. So beautiful thing. Like, you know God, needs to... God created good and evil need... and stuff, but he did what? What's our duty? Yeah, everybody... Hold that. Give me Ecclesiastes. Hold that. Give me Ecclesiastes 12 and 13 real quick. I'm going to show you something. So, now back. Sorry, verse 12. Start verse 12, because if we be in many books and many philosophies and stuff, we would just have to focus on the keeping the commandments. That's all we need. That's all we ever needed. But we said, no, you don't need nothing. Why not? Yes? Let's read it. The book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 12, and verse 13. Start verse 12. In verse 12. And further, by these, my son, be admonished of making many books. There is no end. There's books and then there's doctrines and philosophies, sir. And a lot of people be in it. They always ignore the word of God. Watch this. Jump down to verse 13 now. In verse 13. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear God and keep his commandments. So we're supposed to fear God and keep his commandments and stuff. A book is inside of you. A book is right here. What, what scripture is that? that? What scripture is that? Let me show you something. No. Give me Isaiah 8 and 16. I'm going to show you something. The Lord is not going to be set in our minds until Christ comes back. Give me Isaiah 8 and 16. This is the book of instruction. I'm going to show you. Stay with me. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. What was your question again? Do you think God going to hate you if I show everybody the world you mean, you gotta tell them to keep the commandments. That's how you love God. I'm just saying, you think God is gonna hate me for telling everybody else to love him? He hates those that don't keep the commandments. Watch this, read. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 8, and verse 16. Bind up the testimony, seal the law amongst my disciples. And this is not gonna happen until Christ comes back. That's when the laws is going to be sealed. I'm not screaming. I'm just talking loud so everyone around us can hear. I'm edifying everybody. Watch it. Isaiah 58 and 1. Watch this. I'm going to show you what I do. It's biblical. I know, but watch this. Isaiah 58 and 1. I'm going to show you I'm not going by my own mind. Watch this. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 58 and verse 1. Cry aloud. That's all I'm doing. Why? So all my people can hear me. Even Christ spoke loud. That's why it said the voice of many waters. Read that again. Cry aloud, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet, and show my people their transgression. And that's what I'm out here doing. I'm showing our people their transgression.
Jonathan, go back where we were at. The book of Judges, chapter 1 and verse 8, verse 8. This book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth. But this Bible is not going to depart out of my mouth. Watch this read. But thou shalt meditate therein day and night. Because I'm supposed to meditate in God's law day and night. So you saying we don't got to keep the laws? That thou may observe to do according to all that is written therein. So we got to do all that's written there in the Old Testament uh, and the New know. Testament. Watch this. Matthew 1916. Watch this. Let me show you something. Watch this. You want to know how I believe, sir? Because this happened to our people. This is written in the Bible. That's why I believe. Three. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 19, and verse 16. And behold, one come and said unto him, Good master, what good things shall I do that I may have eternal life? And he said unto him, Read that again. The book of Matthew, chapter 19 and verse 16. And behold, what came and said unto him, Good master, what good things shall I do that I may have eternal life? Verse 17. And he said unto him, Why thou callest me good? There is none good but one. That is God. But if thou wilt enter into life, keep the commandments. So Christ, wait, wait, wait. Christ said keep the commandments, right? Hold on, sir. Christ said keep the commandments. Hold on. You Watch this. Let me join, I think, 10 and 10. Wait a minute. You said the old, that's the Old Wait Testament. I'm going to show no, you no, no, Christ no. kept laws that's in the Old Testament. No, 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 he kept no. the what? Priest of dedication. John 10, 22. This is the book of John, chapter 10, and verse 22. And it was at Jerusalem, the feast of... Hold on. Don't go nowhere. I'm showing you that Christ kept Old Testament and the Propagrapha laws, sir. Don't, don't run. Read. The book of John, chapter 10, and verse 22. And it was at Jerusalem, the feast of dedication. It was the what? The feast of dedication. Hey, sir, this is a law from the Apocrypha. Read that again. The book of John, chapter 10, and verse 22. And it was at Jerusalem, the feast of dedication. And it was winter. So Christ kept the laws in the New Testament. Now yeah, give me right. Matthew 5 and 17. Matthew 5 and 17. Hey, Roy, come back. Give me Matthew 5 17. Hey, sir. Hey, sir. Cat. Got any cat right here. Hey, sir. If you got any questions, come on over, man. We got you. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 5, and verse 17. Think not that I am come to destroy the law or the prophets. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. Read it again. The book of Matthew, chapter 5, and verse 17. Think not that I am come to destroy the law. So Christ said, think not that I come to destroy the law or the prophets. Can you got questions? Yeah. Read. Think not that I am come to destroy the law. Law or the prophets. Think not I come to destroy the law or the prophets. Where? The prophets right here in the Old Testament. You got Amos, Ezekiel, Daniel, that's the prophets. Read again for him. Think not that I have come to destroy the law or the prophets. I am so he said, think not that I come to destroy the law. He's not talking about you. He said, think not that I come to destroy the law or the prophets. Because a lot of people here, yeah, Amos. Ezekiel, Daniel. Uh, but I'm him, though. You said what, sir? I'm him. H Y M N. No, sir, no. I was about to tell you what the fuck I am. You say you're a prophet? You I are a prophet. I said I'm him. What does that mean? Him, my name, bro. Oh, your name is him. Okay, I'm Zechariah. My back misunderstanding. I'm okay. Him for no reason. Name is him? All right. That's why I'm to a real godly spirit, bro. Like, Read that again. Okay. Think not that I have come to destroy the law or the prophets. Or the what? Or the prophets. Or the again. prophets. Pause again. Why would he kill the prophets? Oh, because they did wrong? No, nah, he's saying, think not that I've done away with God's laws right. or anything that the prophets said about me. That's what he's trying to talk about. That makes sense, bro. Yeah. So watch this. Give me the, go like back that. to Leviticus 19 and 17. Bro, him is a cool name. I don't know you know. I watch anime. It's an anime character. He watch him. You know what I'm saying? I don't watch anime. You don't watch anime? Nah, oh, yeah, but that's a cool name, though, bro. I watch porn. <laughs> nah, don't watch that, bro. Don't, no, don't watch porn. I'm going to watch porn, bro. It's my videos, bro. Give me all Matthew Will, 19 and 6. 
Wait, read that real quick. Watch this. The book of Leviticus chapter 19 and verse 17. Thou shalt not hate thy brother in thy heart. Thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor. So this is the law, bro. You're not supposed to hurt? Hate our brothers. You're supposed to correct our brothers. Read it again. Thou shalt not hate thy neighbor in thy heart. Thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor and not suffer sin upon him. Thou shalt not advance nor bear any grudge against the children of thy people. Against the children of our people. But so, you know, porn is like a lusty thing. Give oh, me first Peter. You say so after the Bible? No, no, Give me no, no, first Peter Bible. 1 and 14. You disagree with what I'm saying. I said both of Okay, okay. All praise. Oh, yeah, Okay. Okay, watch this. Let me show you something. Hey, bro, if you love us, you put that cigarette down. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. God said that word. The book of Uh, 1 Peter chapter 1 and verse 14. As obedient children, not fashioning yourselves according to the former lusts in your ignorance. So that's a formal lust. Part of secret. That's a lust. You gotta let that stuff go. Give me uh, 1 Corinthians oh, 3, yeah, 3 and 16. Now I'm listening to Part of cigarette? No, just listen. Oh, we gotta deal with the cigarette though, bro. I love you, man. I want you, you to repent. Well, bro. He said because this world's doing it? I didn't say this world. I don't blame her. Nobody. Okay. I what the fuck I wanted to do because I was giving that law from God. To, to do what you want to do? No. Give me Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Again. The whole duty of man is keeping God's commandments. Because the reason we're at the bottom of society is because we don't know God. We don't do what he tells us to do. The book of Ecclesiastes chapter 12 and verse 13. To the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear God and keep his commandments. For the very God and keep his commandments. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold, from Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone, 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.